Welcome back. It is your feel-good breakfast here, Espresso on SABC3. Now, I, including the rest of the crew here in our studio, have been very, very excited to hear our next uh, guest, of course, perform here live in our studio. Her name is Msaki, a young lady who's doing it all herself as an independent up-and-coming recording art artist under her own recording label called One Shushu Day. And she's here to bring us a very shushu performance on this Monday morning. Here she is with Liwa Lentizio featuring Ella. <laughs>
Absolutely, well, in I, I felt like you were singing that song for me, honestly. I know you weren't there, but wow, what a, what a moving performance and what a way to start off our Monday morning. Thank you very much. Are you okay there? Yeah. Are you right with the microphone? Okay, there we go. I hope it <laughs> stays there. It. Oh, because it's on your guitar strap. But I, I want to first start off, that song, Li what what does it mean and what is that song all about? Um, it's a song I wrote when I was taking the leap into beginning my career as a musician full-time, 2012. Okay. And there's a part in the song that says, Sabelo Sam, does Sabela Nam. And that just basically means, you're my portion and I will answer the call. Hmm. And it's just a, a courage song that I needed for myself. And it's also just about water and, and love. That is just absolutely amazing. All the way uh, from the Eastern Cape, and you, you're going home today, right? You were yeah, saying. Yeah, I'm homesick. You've been, <laughs> <laughs> she's homesick now, <laughs> missing hubby. But you've been all around, you've been p p performing. How have those been going, those shows that you've been doing all around the country? How are people receiving your music, especially now, like you said, you've taken that leap now? Well, it's a beautiful thing because like, as an independent company, you don't have access to 3,000 people at a time. I yeah. play to 40 people at a time, 60 people at a time, and it's those <laughs> intimate connections where I can actually track with them and say, this is what I'm trying to do. And then, especially since I'm, rec I'm recording my, my, my debut album now yes. and I'm working on it towards the end of the year. And so to make those connections with people that will follow you in a way that makes... That is like a, a, pr a proper gift is, yes. is, is, is important. So it's a lot of hard work because it's lots of shows to little people, but yeah, it's, yeah. it's meaningful to me. At it's the building up a solid base yeah. for you. But tell me about that decision to go independent. I mean, with a talent like yours, you play an instrument, you've got a stunning voice. You could have gone to a record label and asked them to sign. I'm sure they would have done so any, any given day. Why not? Um, yeah, I think it's just... Uh, also just the creative freedom of being able to mix with the people that I, that I want to mix with creatively. Um, sometimes old money can dictate your creative parts. And, and I mean, it's an option. Yeah, I'm not close to it, but at, at the meantime, I have a lot to do on my own. Oh, man. Think, yeah. Well, I, I'm loving the work that you bring out on your own, and please keep it coming. We're going to be hearing some more music from Msaki a bit later on. And thank you very much to Ella. Ella has to go and teach at Hart <laughs> High School. Okay, we're going to let her go now while we catch up with the latest news headlines.